kids cooking and crafts. I'm Ava and today I'll be showing you how to make a DIY super secret stash book. Let's get right into it. The things you will need is some decoupage, a paintbrush, a bowl, a box cutter, a permanent marker, a thick book, a ruler, and some plastic wrap. First, you want to skip some pages in the front of your book. Grab your ruler and you want to make sure that your lines are straight and just go and leave a little bit of space in between and just like make your lines like that. And we're gonna cut out inside of the rectangle using a box cutter. These are really sharp, so my cameraman is gonna help us. Right, cameraman? Great. For this next step, we will be using this decoupage. It's seriously like Elmer's glue. We don't want the front of our book to be sticky, so we're, gonna, we're just gonna wrap it up with some saran wrap. So I put a rubber band here so that the saran wrap can stay in place. Now I'm just gonna get our glue and paint around the edges so that the pages can stay together. This will dry clear, so it's okay if you be a little messy. You just wanna make sure that you get all of the edges. Now time to do the inside. This is the tricky part because you don't want the glue on top of the page. Because if you shut the book, it will get glued together. And so we're just gonna do it on the inside around the edges. Don't let it drip. Oh yeah! Oh, this is gonna look so cool when we're finished. There we go. We're all finished. Now we have to put something heavy on it and so that it will dry flat. How about a gumbo machine? You have a few of those laying around your house, don't you? Now we'll let it dry for a couple of hours. But for you, it will only feel like two seconds. One, two. See, told you so. All right, just gonna. All right, let's see how it's doing. Whoa, this is so smooth. Will it pick up? <laughs> nope. Yeah, I think it's pretty solid. Okay, you put that one here. Ooh, yeah, that's good. Will it come up? Nope. All right, let's take off the saran wrap. Hmm, I wonder what's on page 19. Whoa! What? My whole hand can fit in this thing. Look, it won't open. Oh. Guys, what should we hide in it? <laughs> this is so cool. Let's see what else we can hide in this baby. It's money! All of my jewels! Hmm, what else could fit in my super secret stash book? Aha! It's Belle! Oh wow, she's so cute! Fits perfectly. <gasps> it's the key to my diary! Cause I wanna keep my diary super secret. They're Lego guys! Whoa! This is so cool! I wonder what else we can fit in here. Ooh, my trusty flashlight! Ooh! Ring pop, anyone? Ooh! Do you like my rings? 
we need to hide these from my brother. <gasps> it's R2-D2! He's my favorite character of Star Wars. Thank you guys so much for making this DIY super secret stash book with me. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below on what you would fit in your secret stash book. Bye! and I'm here with my two favorite dudes, Superman and Batman. So today we'll be doing a quick, easy DIY necklace tutorial. Let's get started. So these are the supplies we need. We need foam paper, hole puncher, pair of scissors, some string, glue sticks, and then these little tiny beads. They're so pretty, they look like the rainbow. And my favorite part is what is inside this chest. Ah! The gems! First, we're gonna cut the foam into our favorite shape.
our quick and easy DIY necklace tutorial. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment below. Make sure to check out some of our other videos.